surprise. Hey guys! We just got such good feedback from our last video about hope and hard times that we wanted to share with you the other things that God has been speaking to both of us. And it all is starting off with a confession. My confession is that I tend to forget that in life, boys are not going to fully satisfy my heart. And I also am like here to confess that I forget that God's the only person that's going to be consistent in my life. The reason we're making this video is to let you know and also remind ourselves that Jesus is the only one who can satisfy our hearts. No person, no thing, nothing on this earth will satisfy you, honestly. We all have this deep desire in our hearts to be known and loved. Yeah. And we feel that and we feel that emptiness mm -hmm. um, and we try to fill that. And because we were created for love, Jesus created us for love. Mm -hmm. Just we're looking for love in the wrong places. We wanted to talk about how Jesus died for our sins on the cross, so now we can have salvation. But oftentimes, we overlook the other gift that He's given us, which is intimacy with God, like the creator of yeah. everything. Yeah, actual relationship with Jesus. Growing up, I didn't understand what relationship with God even meant. After actually taking time out of my day to spend time in the Word and in prayer, that's when I realized I hear the Lord, He speaks, and He only wants what's best for me. And through Jesus' sacrifice, we can come before Him in prayer, and mm -hmm. He looks on us with love and fully accepts us. This desire in our hearts to be fully known and fully loved is satisfied in Him, in relationship with Him. I think back to all the years I didn't ever understand that, and the second God came into my life, that's when I came alive. And I think a lot of us have these preconceptions that God loves us great. Like, what does that mean, and like, what is the extent of that love? I know I struggle with like understanding that, and a lot of times I feel unworthy of that, so that's why I run from His love. Mm -hmm. But in reality, His love is not moderate for us. It's not like, slightly there. It's the greatest love. It, he defines love. love. Yeah. Yeah. And Jesus is love. Being in close relationship with him and accepting that is what satisfies your heart, yeah. in my opinion. It will do so much for you. He is moving and alive and waiting to speak to you. I think a lot of times we, we just walk away from that when he's just waiting there for us. Yeah. No matter what we've done in our lives, no matter what you've done in your life, no matter what is going on in your life, Jesus still wants the best for you. He still loves you that much. Take it from us, like, how long have you been single, Tylan? Probably like three years now. <laughs> Me too! And our hearts are so satisfied because we have something that's unshakable and that's Jesus Christ. Even when I was in a relationship, I was trying to find full satisfaction in someone that couldn't give it to me because it's not humanly possible. Relationships aren't a bad thing at all. Like, yeah. God wants to bless us with yeah. awesome relationships. We're built for relationships. Never try and find your identity in someone, someone else. Because yeah. it will destroy you, I promise you that. I've been down that path. Even the most godly Christian guys you know will fail you at times. The most perfect marriages you see will fail at times. And it's not because I'm saying every relationship's gonna fail, it's because a lot of people are trying to look for full satisfaction in those relationships when it's not possible, except for having God there. Yeah, so we just wanted to let you guys know that you're crazy loved by yeah. God, and He wants to know you, he, he does know you, He wants you to know Him, yeah. and if you have any questions about that or you want to talk to us about that, Totally feel free to. But we love you guys. We love you so much. And we want to pray for you. So yeah. if you need anything, you know where to find us. In this little video square. <laughs> yes, this little box. So awkward. <laughs> <laughs> okay. Yeah, we're just praying that Jesus will speak to you this week, mm -hmm. that you will find yourself in Him, and you will even find Him. Oh, if you have any other video requests for us, you yes. can let us know of those. Yeah. And we'll get on that. That's about it. Yep. Bye! <laughs> no, that was really awkward. <laughs> yeah. We'll see you guys in our next video, hopefully. Yep. Bye! Okay, perfect. <laughs>